hey guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here you're highly welcome in today's video i'm going to be reviewing this tab pc and these stylus pens a quick disclaimer here i am not a tech guru i don't know the terms to use and all of that but i have been using this tab for two years now and i just felt to share for uni students who are interested in having two in one properties because i mean two is better than one isn't it but anyway this is how the tab pc looks like i'm going to be calling it tabby loss because i use it as a tab more than a pc but it runs on windows only this is not one of those tab pcs that you can change from windows to android it runs on just windows and here you have your speakers you have the rear camera you have a reset button to go back to factory setting this part of the um tab pc had a velvety feel at first so as i said i've been for two years hence the scratches that you see so here you have a volume the volume rockers the volume up and volume down and also you have a micro sd card slot it can take up to 128 gig of storage and that is amazing and on one side of the tab pc you get a lot of um, buttons and ports first of all you have the start button and also you have a usb port and you have the power on button you have a headphone jack or a microphone jack here and also you have a us i think it's a usb type c i don't know what it's called but you have a charging port where you can charge you also there are two charging ports here you have the normal or the usual dc adapter charging port and also the usb charging port and that is really awesome because when one is not working the other is working and then you have a mini hdmi and a microphone i like the fact that everything all the buttons and all the ports are placed on one side of the tab pc and other parts are bare it just makes for easy control this is how it looks forgive this crack on the screen as i said i've been using it for two years now and when you have siblings things like this are expected to happen so guys i forgot that i didn't tell you the name of this tab pc i mean we call it tab the name is so long this tab pc is called an rca and it's about 10 inches wide okay and it comes with a pretty sleek keyboard and mouse set and this is the only thing you have on the keyboard parts it's just the keyboard and the mouse so let's power it on and check out the features and the specifications it has a front facing camera but the camera is not the best trust me So let's check out the storage capacity for this tab PC. This tab PC runs on or has a 32 gig worth of storage. But initially when you get this tab PC, you don't get the whole 32 gig worth of storage because about 3.8 or 3.6 is being used up or being occupied by the system app which unfortunately you cannot delete if you are not making use of any so you have about 28.6 or 28.8 gig worth of storage and it's okay because of the option of a micro SD card and other specification is that it runs on a Windows 10 it has 2 gig watt of ram 2 gig watt of ram it has 2 gig ram and also it runs on a 32 bit operating system times 64 intel processor i sound like i know what i say but in all honesty i do not know what i what i'm saying but i guess it's fine because i mean so now let's check out other features in this tab pc it has a touch screen capacity or a touch capacity and that is pretty slick 
obviously to be used as a tablet you should be able it should be a touch screen okay you have a tablet mode here but irrespective of the tablet mode you can still use this as a tablet and it is detachable to be used as a tablet obviously it has auto rotation and can rotate in all four corners or four sides of the tab and that is pretty useful especially in this case where i have a broken screen this is the part that gets connected to the keyboard when you want to use it as a laptop so this is the keyboard there's nothing really fancy about this keyboard um what you get on the keyboard is just your regular keys and the mouse itself i think this material is plastic as i said there's nothing fancy about the keyboard it just has a lot of screws and just the parts for attaching to the main event which is the tab okay but here's the downside to using this as a tab and a pc immediately is that it loses orientation i mean when used as a tab and you want to use it as a pc again or a laptop again you have to give it some kind of orientation like what i'm doing right now you just tilt it back and forth to give it an information that oh hello i want to use it as a laptop but this didn't start when i got it obviously it it just started about two months ago but i don't i don't think it's a big deal because you just need to give it some kind of orientation but it works fine i think it works pretty fine now let's do a brief touch test basically i want to show you how fast it can open apps and scroll while using it as a touch screen and i think it's pretty fast in my opinion as you can see you could judge for yourself so let's try opening some applications and see how fast they open There are four ways that this laptop can be oriented using the keyboard as the stand. First as a regular laptop, then in this way using the keyboard as a stand, then you can move it the way you like. The thing about using it this way, I mean when you're backing the keyboard is that you cannot make use of the keyboard obviously. You can just use it, you can only use the touch capacity this is another orientation you can have and it's really nice to have these features and this is another way i really don't use it like this but this is another way so now let's move over to the universal stylus pen i recently got these and they have been really helpful you know in highlighting text um, digital note taking because I've been trying that lately and this is the touch part it, it has two it came in twos I don't know why um, it has a touch feature and also an ink pen feature basically you can use it as a normal pen on paper kind of situation so now let's test this out to test this pen out, I am going to be using the Microsoft OneNote. These pens are pretty inexpensive if you ask me. And when I got them, I thought I just ordered for one. I thought it was, it was just going to be one that would come, but two came instead. And well, why not enjoy the benefits of that? Either way, this is not a branded pen. I'm going to try and leave the link to where I got this pen or in the description box. The link to this laptop will be impossible because I did not get it online. My mom got it for me when I was in school and she sent it over in 2018 and I do not know where she got it from, but I'm going to look for places that you can find this laptop leave it in the description box if you would be interested in purchasing this so since two years now i haven't found a need to take this tab pc to a computer store 
and in my opinion it has been working perfectly i hope you enjoyed this video because this is the end of the video and i hope this video was useful to you and don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you have not subscribed and i will see you in my next one bye